I'm not suggesting that I have a blueprint for a perfect planet, but Natural United will be directly aimed at helping the air, water, and land of this planet for the future generations that inhabit this Earth. Thank you guys very much for your time. So I was walking through the woods in high school and a thought came across my head and it was that there used to be amazing things in the outdoors that are now gone as a result of human action. And so that's when I first had my idea for Natural United. And the core belief of our company is that the air, water, and land of our planet are the most essential of the health to the human species. And um, after doing a lot of research, a few things that I discovered were that 90% of humans are not breathing clean air, and that 7 million people die every year from breathing air that is polluted. This is something that I think really could change as a result of the way that we build our infrastructure out, but we haven't figured out a way to do it in the way that there are things that people died from 200 years ago because they hadn't figured out solutions. This is one of those things. But on top of that, a difficulty is that the water that we're drinking has chemicals like fluoride, chlorine, lead, mercury, and arsenic, and they're common in water throughout the world. The majority of people on Earth still do not have access to running water or flushing toilets. And this is something that I think is, is a result of the infrastructure that we currently have built out in a way that doesn't necessarily reach everyone around the world. And I know that cities are definitely our greatest potential in protecting the future of humanity, given that only 15% of the land that we have right now on Earth is preserved. That's a number that I think would increase if we were able to have a society that benefited all of humans. Um, and on top of that, when we think of the majority of the space on Earth, 71% of it is covered by oceans. And the oceans have it worse than any other aspect of the world. And the most common example when people talk about why that is, the Great Pacific Garbage Patch, it's west of California and east of China, is at the smallest end of the estimate twice the size of Texas. It's a microplastic fiber floating around all of the ocean currents. And this is something that's been incredibly terrible for the rest of the animal life on the planet. And both through the seas and on land, we've seen species extinction as a result of human action has been accelerated by a thousand times the natural rate of what it would have been had humans not existed. That's something that's astonishing to think about considering the way that we're living will continue to make that happen. And Earth is home to about three trillion trees right now, which is less than half of what it was when humans did not exist. And so that is obviously something that would be apt to change because honestly, it could probably do humans well if there are more trees since the time we got here. We've already figured out that they're great for our health, but we're still cutting down 15 billion every year. And that's pretty insane to me. So we're basically the first generation though that has the ability to change this. Um, with modern technology, we're capable of communicating with people in every end of the earth. And what that means is that we can figure out sustainable practices that allow us to share the earth with everyone and actually focus on the earth, the air, and the water of this planet. Something that I think would be an amazingly conscious move of humanity to do for the future generations of this planet. And this is just something that I wanted to say so that in the future I could look back on this video and know that that was something that I was conscious of and hoping to change. Is it bad to have a Leafly sticker? That is totally your call, this is your page. Is it funny? I like it. Is it forward? Um, no, it's super subtle. Especially in this shot. It's just colors. I think he's got to be raised a little bit. Mm -hmm.